The click creates a harness horse. Here I'm getting her used to the idea of shafts. And now I'm showing her to move away from shaft pressure. And um, have a helper so I can work from behind where I'll be when I'm in the cart. And I'm teaching her to move her shoulder as she will have to, to move her shoulder into the shafts. And getting her used to noisy objects behind. Putting on the harness. And learning to drag things with the harness. Dragging a tire there. And putting the idea of shafts and harness together. And <coughs> using a pretend shaft and putting it in the shaft tug there. And just waiting for her to straighten her head. She thinks she's supposed to target something, so I'm just waiting quietly until she straightens her head, and then I'll give her a click and treat. There. And now I'm putting together the shafts and the harness and asking her just to move away from pressure of the shafts. Now we're driving with two shafts. And finally, the idea of backing into a narrow space. There, her tail's touching the back. Free shaping, getting introduced to the cart. And the cart moving around. <laughs> Lifting up the shafts like she will have to be used to when we're actually putting her into the cart. And walking in position with the cart Finally, we put together the harness and back again to the cart and did that very nicely indeed. Click and treat. And just getting used to the idea of pulling the cart. We do a lot of walking together so she's comfortable walking along with me on the ground. And the idea of someone getting into the cart and finally someone riding in the cart and the groom is still on the ground with her to give her confidence. And gradually the groom unclips and moves away and she's driving on her own. Then the idea of the groom getting on as well. And finally driving together.